What? Well, I will look anywhere for a cheap miniature, including the clearance aisle of my grocery store, where I found these Kinder Joys. Now, I saw that they had dinosaur skeletons, so I decided to spend 25 cents to see what they look like. And frankly, they look okay. Unfortunately, the front legs are not very well detailed, and even after a quick wash, this miniature might be nice for a little bit of scene decoration, but not quite detailed enough for an actual miniature. Don't waste your 25 cents on these. But something that I found that wasn't a waste of my money was this Loot Crate Dragon Age Inquisition Dragon that I found at the thrift store for $6. Now, obviously, I think Loot Crate is a bit of a scam. I would not suggest you spend your hard-earned money on the actual Loot Crates to try to get miniatures because there's no guarantee you're going to get a good quality miniature. Basically, you're going to find these things in the thrift stores after the fact anyways. So be on the lookout in thrift stores, but don't actually buy these new. This Dragon Age Inquisition Dragon ended up looking okay, you can see it's just a very basic paint job, nothing very special at all. If you happen to need like a bronze or maybe a brass dragon, it's okay. I think actually this is almost a step below the pre-painted dragons that WizKids is putting out, which is frankly shocking to me that this is supposed to be a premium item. It's clearly not. Now I can think of quite a few video game statues which might make really good D&D miniatures, but this one is not one of them. However, at the $6 mark, I am happy enough to have this in my arsenal of miniatures. Those were just a couple of my completely random miniature finds as of late. If you found anything interesting in a thrift store or in a clearance section of a grocery store, please let me know in the comments below.